in yet another move that promises to push Korea and Japan even further apart diplomatically. Japan has officially confirmed plans to revise teaching guidelines to beef up its claims over Korea's Tokyo Island. Seoul's foreign ministry responds predictably. Our Hwang Sung Yi has the details. Japan has officially confirmed it will revise educational guidelines to bolster its claims over Korea's Tokyo Island. A move Seoul has warned will further damage their already frosty ties. During a press conference on Tuesday, Japanese Education Minister Hakubun Shimomura said Tokyo will revise its teaching manuals for middle and high schools since it's important for students to have a correct sense of Japanese territory. The minister did not elaborate on the details of the revision, but according to Japanese media, the new teaching guidelines will claim that Tokyo is illegally occupied by Korea. These manuals are often used as reference materials to certify textbooks, which means more Japanese textbooks could state incorrect territorial facts down the road. Seoul's foreign ministry slammed the move, saying Japan must drop its unjustified claims at once. Japan must immediately withdraw these unjustified claims. Let me reiterate that doing this would lay the path for friendlier ties between Korea and Japan. Tokyo has long been a thorn in Seoul-Tokyo relations, with Japan continuously laying claim to the islets in school textbooks and government reports. In its latest effort to counter Japan's territorial claims over Tokyo, the Korean government released an online video clip on New Year's Day promoting its sovereignty and said that this clip will soon be available in English and also in Japanese. Hwang Sang-hee, Arirang News.